Hello everyone, today I'll be showing you how to game rip games on itch.io. Without further ado, let's get into the video. For this video, we're going to be using the game The Deepest Sword, because why not? It's an easy game, and you, you can pretty much do this with almost any game, but first thing when it comes to game ripping is we want to find the actual source of the game. We don't want all this garbage here or anything like that. So with itch.io you can just open up dev tools get the little selection hover over like where the game is and you can see all this garbage what you want to look for is iframe this is where you want there's usually a source value and then your url should look somewhat like this so if we put that in a new tab wait for it to load and then boom we just have the game right here that's pretty much the first step done. Now that we got the actual game frame, we need to start creating offline copy of it. So we we'll open up File Explorer here. We we'll go over to Documents, create a new folder, and just title it Sword. Next, where you can open up your favorite code editor or whatever. Open up the folder. Go to Documents. Go to Sword and. There we go. We have our folder open. Now what we want to do is just start off with index.html. This is the base of the game. While we're there, we can start our little live server. Allow access. Okay. So now, control U. Just control C, control V. Save. And we can go to our live server. And you can tell things aren't working if we go to devtools console not many things are working well so this is a simple fix we should go over to network give it a reload and then this is the probably the most complicated part of game ripping is finding the files that are missing because most of the time you have these little script tags they lead to other things because most games they're not just one html file so we need to find this file and download it here so we're gonna go back over to our game Let's open up dev tools hit a little reload and you see this is easy because we only have a few files so we have this pay attention to the url so in terms of this game, it's in, in the build folder, and the file is webbuilds.loader.js. So we can just control C, and then this is where it's linked to. Control click to say, oh no, that file's not found. You create it. So let's cop copy everything here. Save it in. And let's close it. See? And now we have the loader.js, but we still have a few more files to handle. So we could just get this framework. And if you want to go super fast, you could just save the file and kaboom. Let's see. Then there's the data folder. This is pretty much all the Unity assets and all that compiled for the web. So now let's make sure over here all of these are inside of the build folder so we can open up explore go to our downloads get these three files and we should be able to just plop them in the builds folder come on there we go now you notice this one didn't really pan out that well so let's go back over here download it and make sure we get the proper title so Control S for save. And then make sure it's JavaScript and kaboom. So now we can go over here, hit our file in. Okay. Now let's head over here and look at that. We have the deepest sword now. This is pretty much simple game ripping. You just download the files, make sure that they're in the proper order. If you see any red text here, that's probably bad. And now, 
you can close this and we have this entire game here so if you want to upload it to Replay, whatever thanks for watching and uh i might make more soon